Uh, last year was kind of a 500 team. What? Uh, how do you see this group compared to last year? Well, we're extremely athletic. Mm -hmm. We have a, a really good mix of youth and veteran players at the AAA level. Uh, you know, uh, I think with Travis Darno and Anthony Ghost, uh, first time in AAA, uh, very talented, athletic uh, two fellows there with Hetcheverry at shortstop, mm -hmm. uh, very athletic as well. You know, it's a very good middle. Center of our of our team offensively, I think we've got uh, just a, a really good mix of speed and power, and uh, it, it should be a very fun season to watch because these guys, you know, Anthony Ghost is coming off the last two seasons stealing 70 bases. Uh, Travis Darno, you know, he, he was the MVP of the Eastern League. Uh, Hetcheverry, if he would have stayed in Double A and you know not come here last year, he hit 389 in Triple A. So defense like no other shortstop. Head. So it's uh, those things are very exciting to as a manager to be able to go in with that type of talent and just make sure that, that there's a consistency level that they have to learn about at this level. I know Travis Snyder's back too, so it sounds like this team is real yeah, well he, done. And he's you know as a 24 year old young talented outfielder that has uh, you know experienced the major leagues in a very positive way, and then and then he had his struggles you know last year. But to come down here with the attitude that he has, it shows his true leadership ability. And uh, he's come in with a great attitude. He wants to, he obviously wants to get back to the big leagues, but he's a really good example of how he's going to find out how good he can be because he's, he lives in the moment. You know, he's, he's living to be here right now. And if somebody chooses to take him someplace else, he'll show up and he'll do his gig there too. So he's just, a, he's a very mature young man for 24. I guess the, the key for this team will be how far you're starting country. That's, take, that's yeah. pretty well the key in yeah. every league, but more so for us. I think our bullpen is much more consistent and sound than it was last year. Um, our starters this year, uh, they've got their challenges cut out for them. We feel really good about you know Aaron Laffey. feel good about all of our starters, but some of them are, are question marks. And like uh, you know, Chavez hasn't started in a long time. Hmm. This is going to be a real uh, different thing for him. Uh, you know, Murphy was in Japan, and we had uh, he's had a, a spring in which he's shown flashes of doing good things you know uh, you've got Tim Redding coming you know he's a veteran type guy and, and when he's right he can still run the ball up there above 90 and command his fastball as well so we'll see you know Scott Richmond coming back off of a very uh, challenging year last year uh, he just had a really tough time it was a tough year for him he's had a good spring he's throwing the ball better now we're going to find out you know he'll be tested early and we'll find out how he does so it's just a matter if those guys can get us deep enough into games to get to our pin uh, we're, we're going to be okay offensively I believe a lot more exciting type team though because you're so much sure athletic I guess there'll be a lot of yeah, more running and, and that type of stuff just guys that mm -hmm. uh, good instincts mm -hmm. and I think uh, you know, it's going to set them apart from other groups because they just, uh, it's not so much breaking everything down like you would like an A-ball player. You're looking at a guy athletically, he can do a lot of things. You just have to get him to use those things and make him consistent, that's all. And I know as you got other pitchers, you didn't mention Jim Huey, Bobby Gorecki, all these guys have oh, big yeah, league experience, huh? Yeah, I mean, Gorecki did a great job here <laughs> last year, and then and Double A did a great job. They, they won a championship down there. Uh, Hoey, I'm really excited about. He's thrown the ball exceptionally well this spring. Uh, Chad Beck coming back, who's probably going to close for us. He's, uh, you know, he's learning that that role as a closer, and he's kind of going to be thrown into the fire. But I think he's got, he's going to have a lot of uh, positive things around him in Hoey, uh, Quayle, uh, Gill. You know, these guys have all been in the bullpen and done well, so it'll be a good experience for Chad to learn that too. Still get butterflies for opening night? Always. I love opening day. <laughs> yeah, I think, you know, even as a kid growing up, you watched. So one thing you saw on TV was opening day and how exciting it was for not only the players and, you know, and, and coaching staff and stuff, but the fans, too. They really get It's just the start of a whole new year.